Alright, hi everyone. Okay, so this next video that I'm recording, it's actually to find the acceleration for a strip. Okay, so from the previous videos, I have already did this particular strip, the good timer strip, and I have this chart. There is nine strips over here from number one to nine. So because I want to do calculations, so I am gonna take for strip number nine because it's longer and it's easier for me to read. So what I'm gonna do is for strip number nine, okay, I have to find the initial, uh, this is my initial part, okay. So this is the initial reading from here to here. So this is my initial. I'm gonna label this as A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, N, K. Alright, so I'm sure all of you can see that. So what I'm gonna do first is that, okay, we have to solve a few things. Number one, okay. The ticker timer's frequency is 50 hertz. Okay, so this means that one tick. All right, what is one tick? Okay, so this is my strip. One of this is called a dot. Okay, so I have four dots here. In between two dots. This is what we call as tick. Okay? So one tick is equivalent to 1 over 50, which is 0 0.02. So that would give us 0 0.02 seconds because hertz is also equivalent to second negative 1. Hertz unit is also equivalent to second negative 1. So 1 tick is 1 over 50, which is equal to 0 0.02 seconds. Now, we have to find the average velocity because we know the formula for acceleration A is V minus U over T. Okay, so we need to find the initial velocity, which is for uh, U. Okay, so average. Yeah, that's the form 3 recess bell, so you know when I'm doing this video already, right? So for A to B, which is actually U, is, I have to measure this distance, so I'm going to measure this, from here to B, that is actually in between of 1.7. Seven, so I'm going to take the reading as 1.7 Okay So 1.7 cm Because from A to B is 1 tick So 1 tick value is 0 0.02 Okay, so I have a calculator here So I'm going to clear all my mode first So 1.7 Divided by 0 0.02 seconds That would be 85 centimeter second negative one okay so that's the average velocity for uh, a to b that's the initial velocity so next i have to find the average velocity for the ending one i have to find v so average velocity for the last one which is j to k j to k all right the last one is j to k so that's why it's J to K here, which is V. So I'm gonna measure J to K. So that's 1.9. Okay, that's 1.9. I'm gonna put the graph away. 1.9 centimeter over 0 0.02. Again, because J to K is one tick. 1.9 divided by 0 0.02 that would be 95 centimeter per second okay so I've already found my U I've already found my V okay so I have to time find my time T all right my time T U V is already found so I'm gonna find T so I'm gonna find T time taken 
okay, for the whole entire strip. Okay, so it's actually from here to here. Now, um, we have to find the value from mid of AB all the way to the middle of JK, right? Because we have already calculated uh, the time one round before, okay? Because here already we already used the time. So, what we normally do is, okay, I normally do this for calculation of the time taken for the whole strip. So, if it's one strip, so it's number of ticks minus 1 multiplied by 0 0.02 second. Okay, so we have to calculate how many number of ticks we have. So, this is 1, okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright, so I have 10 number of ticks here. So, 10 minus 1 times 0 0.02. So, which is 9 times 0 0.02. I will actually get 9 times 0 0.02. I'll get 0 0.18 Okay So I get my readings So you see, I want to find acceleration Has to be V minus U Sorry A, acceleration V minus U Divided by time So I found U I found V And I obviously found time So Acceleration A For the whole entire strip number 9 Is V minus U over T So V My value is 95 minus u, my value is 85, divided by 0 0.18 second, okay, so this unit on top here is centimeter per second, the unit below here is second, hence 95 minus 85, I get 10, so I'm going to write 10 over 0 0.18 divided by 0 0.18 I get 55.56 unit centimeter second I bring it up it will become second negative 2 so this is the acceleration for one strip okay alright so this is the acceleration for one strip Alright, that's all for the first, second part of the video for the ticketing.